For President Trump, questions about transparency start with his taxes and why he's breaking with tradition and not releasing his returns. The lawsuits accusing Trump of violating the emoluments clause of the Constitution. We're just going to trust the foreign government officials who potentially could be trying to influence or bribe the U.S. government to self-report themselves. Jared Kushner and Donald Trump have flouted all kinds of norms when it comes to outside business interests, transparency, what you say about your business. We're learning that at least four countries, Mexico, Israel, the United Arab Emirates, and China, all discussed ways in which Kushner could be used. The administration says it's ending the Obama policy of making visitor logs available. He frequently visits properties that he owns, raising the profile of his private enterprise on taxpayers' dime. And so with the leadership example set, we also see now from expensive travel to financial disclosures, various members of the Trump cabinet also facing questions over their ethics decisions. There's Jared Kushner and how he sought out a back channel that could circumvent U.S. intelligence detection at the Russian embassy. The letter, the first known attempt at direct outreach by Trump to Putin, the letter has been turned over to investigators probing Russia's interference in the 2016 campaign. We see recklessness around national security issues. Uh, scores of West Wing officials don't have the requisite clearances necessary to see the nation's most closely guarded secrets. They have not provided key details to the committee about former staff secretary Rob Porter's background check, timeline, as well as information about the security clearance process. In my opinion, House Republicans are aiding and abetting President Trump's ongoing abuse.